we start, I do want to mention that you're sitting on a phone book. <laughs> you, have, you have to. You I have had to, to say something. Like, there's no way you're this tall, so that's why I had to point it out. That's okay. Just, well, let's get this going. I, I know. You want hair? You need a haircut? I, no, this is good. This really? is good. Yep. That looks pretty long to me. It's the tone of your voice of the surprise that hurts the most. <laughs> really? That's what you were going with? That's <laughs> not. That's, not, that's not a mess, okay, does it? Well, it's getting in my eyes. All right. Yeah. This is what I <laughs> aim for in the morning. This is what I leave the house with. This is what I was going for. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah. All right. The All eye right. contact will continue to stop. Okay. So we should so, get this going. Sure. Russell Walker. Yukari Peerless. And you're watching the latest episode of Getting Engaged. Online, in life, and at work. And we've been talking a lot lately about... Actually, you know what? Before we move in, you before we dive right in, in, I know I wanted to jump in. I was all no, like, "No, I just wanted to mention, like, we're using a new camera. I don't know if you noticed, but um, yeah, two episodes ago, we were out in the middle of Fairfield area. It was kind of we. Oh, we yeah, it yeah. was like a last minute. You had your digital, you know, your flip click and shoot. Died, my and flip I, died. Like, we used my regular digital camera to film, and you could tell, right? Oh, know, <laughs> yeah, the quality is so bad. Um, but the last episode, we that was the first time we used this. Um, Kodak. Yeah, it's a Kodak one. Yeah, Marty uh, Padden or whatever had recommended this one as well. Yeah. yeah. I don't think this was actually available in Canada for a while. It, it might be now. I don't know. But when I was looking into it. So this it, could be illegal. Anyway, but this <laughs> <laughs> this is shop. Uh, no, I got this from John. John P. John Post on Twitter. And thank you, John. So I was thinking. He's from Geek Talk TV, right? What? What did I do wrong? Geek Beat. Damn it. Well, you're the, you're, you know them. I'm just, trying, I'm just, I'm riding your <laughs> coattails. What are you talking well. about? Um, yeah. So I was thinking as long as we use this camera, yeah. as long as we keep using this, I think we, it's safe to say this, not just this episode, like okay. this program is sponsored by John P. <laughs> is it? <laughs> you know, unless we change the camera, but thank you, John. So that's awesome. John, for a man I've never met, I love you very, very much. Thank you for making <laughs> technology possible for this show. You make us look better. And I got, you know, I got it in a little package. I sh didn't I show it? No. It's like in the box. <laughs> you know, the box, the, the center area, it should say like uh, Live It Lobster, their company name, or, you know, John P, whatever. Yeah. But it was it was written Callie Lewis, and he was a man very... His co-host on, on the show. I'm sure she didn't write it. Yeah. It's like somebody, the man's writing. Like squiggly <laughs> Cali. Like, really? Like, I don't think this is Cali's writing. It's not that I've She was making that. sure he followed through. Is that what it was? <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. So let's move on to yes. the uh, our episode uh, topic this week. So what I what I usually like to talk about uh, online. Oh, right? yes. Nice this to flip that back. Wait, we haven't talked in a while. So this is kind of us getting on getting. Um, one of my biggest things with yeah. social media is that people keep forgetting that social media or any online engagement mm -hmm. is exactly the same as offline engagement. Right. It's if, if you put it in real world terms, it's embarrassing how many people interact with one another. Right. Um, what, what, example? For an example, uh, and, and not necessarily the, what I want to dive into, but there's one where, you know, if you see people that are Twittering all the time, Twittering, about, Twittering tweeting, yeah. Facebooking, status updating, yeah. about themselves all the time. Imagine if you're at a party. And there's that one person that talks about themselves all the yeah. time. Are you the one? Or do you want to hang out with that person? No. 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 So why would you want to talk to them and connect with them online? Right. They're just, you know, it, it's narcissistic, mm -hmm. right? And I don't care if you're a business or a person. I, I you know, engage, talk to people. That's the whole mm -hmm. point of the show. Yeah. On the flip side of that, what we were talking and what we're certainly going to talk about today is that, um, oh man, I'm blanking here a little bit. So what it is, is is that how do you introduce yourself when you talk to somebody for the first time, whether you're connecting with them on a platform like LinkedIn or, or Twitter or Facebook or any online property where you're engaging with somebody for the first time, you want to get their attention. Mm -hmm. What's the best method of doing that? Now, recently I've noticed that a lot of people will approach you and immediately want something from you. Like they're not, it's, it's just immediately like, hey, how you doing? Great, why did you want to connect? Just out of curiosity, because I'm looking for a job. What? I've never <laughs> met you. I, I, right. I, I want to not connect yeah, with you now. Yeah, yeah. Like where is this mutual respect or mutual interest or mm -hmm. tribe or community that we need to build? Like mm -hmm. maybe you're desperate for a job and you have no time for chit chat, but if this is a real world situation. That's not gonna work. No, like you walk up to me like, hi, how you doing? John, Russell, job? No, <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Like I need to know yeah. who you are. Right, right, right. So I don't know if you've had a lot of experiences with that, but it's 
It's immediate, yeah. like, can I have something from you? Well, like, I do have people, like, you know, I only hear from them when they want something from me, right? That yeah. happens. So, I'm sure everybody knows that that guy. Yeah, right? well, get those phone calls, those friends that you know only hear from when they actually want something from yeah. you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, I don't understand why people don't seem to see that in an online world mm -hmm. of an offline thing that they wouldn't tolerate right. for themselves, mm -hmm. but they're the first ones to do it themselves. Right. So, I, I just don't understand why there's a disconnect. Why is there a disconnect? I don't know why. Is it because it's so? Is it is it because it's new and people don't understand how to it's, communicate it's, as much? Like social media is not that new anymore, is it? It's new to a lot of people. Really? I mean, for us, it's not because we've been living it. And I mean, Twitter celebrated its sixth birthday like not that long ago. But for a lot of people, it's still really, really new. Okay, but still, it doesn't make it okay. No, it totally doesn't. So I, I don't know Be why. I, the, I don't know because you don't see the person. Maybe that's it. Maybe because you, you know a lot of people are, you know, the, the trolls, like the mm -hmm. trolls of the world right, right. have more confidence to be jerks mm -hmm. because they don't feel like they have that human connection right. with you because you're not face to face with them. Mm -hmm. So maybe it's the same here. You like that? <laughs> yeah, I flipped that. I just, it's like my yeah. little, it's my thumb switch blade. <laughs> like, like, yeah, I think that makes sense though. It does. Yeah. You have that guess, wall of yeah, avatar yeah. wall or yeah, whatever, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah, that's right. I'm not Russell Lulliker. I'm Russ LOL. Yeah. You know, I'm not, I'm not a real person. Who's that person? Dude, you're Curry P, not yeah. you're Curry Peerless. Right. Totally two uh, different people. Right. But it's not. No, no. No, not at all. Huh. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm just kind of curious. So I'm going to put that out there. Like, why is there what a disconnect think? between how you act online and offline mm -hmm. when you're introducing yourself and trying to meet somebody for the first time? Right. You want to butter them up a little bit, you know? Mm -hmm. not, what's in it for me right away? Right. So, yeah, that's what I got. That's a good question. It's a great question because I asked it. <laughs> I have a huge ego. It's the uh, hair. I'm, the I'm hair. trying to build myself up from the hair comment from earlier. That's what I'm doing. Totally, that's what I'm doing. Sorry. Sheesh. So we'd love to hear from you. Um, we're on Google Plus and uh, Facebook. And uh, yeah, we'd, we'd yeah, love to right. know what, what you think on, on, on that. Like, how do you introduce yourself, yourself to new people? Because we're all looking for, you know, those got those influencers or, or people in industries that we want to connect with or, you know, anybody that we want to get to know more from. Mm -hmm. What's the best way to approach them? Mm -hmm. I say find a sh common, common, ask them a question. There you go. Right. Find, a, find a common thread and ask a question about it. I think we went through this before. I'm sure we did. Yeah. But it's ask worth repeating. Ask a question. I do ask a question. Yeah, like absolutely. Five, thing, five way to get engaged or something like that? Yeah. In the past episode? Ask what I call, that's called consistency. Mm -hmm. Referring to an old <laughs> show and we're bringing it back up that's again. Right. Yeah. yeah, it's consistency. Cool. All right. <laughs> well, thanks for watching another episode. That's you, Kari Peerless. This is so long. Sorry, it just threw me off. Right and that's another episode of Get Engaged. Online, in life, and at work. Bye. Bam! Totally changed Bam. our Bam! Yeah. Mm.